Hello everyone and welcome to That Brick Show. Today, it's Friday the 14th of May, thought I'd do a video about um, our YouTube channel and what some of the stats mean. I'm going to do a screen recording and see if that actually works and I'll try and overlay it. Let's turn my Mac down. Just to give a little bit of insight into the sort of stuff on YouTube that's quite interesting regarding the analytics of our channel um, and in particular those that watch our videos that aren't subscribed. Um, I always see a lot of YouTubers they um, say, oh, only 50% of the people that watch our videos are actually subscribers. So I think it'd be really interesting to see how many ours are, what sort of ratio ours are. I haven't looked at this yet and I don't even know where I'm supposed to be looking, but I'm going to do a screen recording and we will see what we can find. Okay, so here we are with the recording. You should be able to see my cursor on the screen now. Just gonna have a look at a few statistics now. I actually need to go to uh, YouTube Studio, I think, for this bit. So let's go there. So this is the interface for YouTube Studio. Um, this gives you a little, like a summary of um, your latest video performance. And that was our latest video. Go check that out if you want to know a bit more about the Studio Guide from Bricklink. It's a way you can build Lego sets digitally and um, render the end result. Have a look at our Instagram on instagram.com slash that brick show to see some renders I've done. I've done things like Sonic the Hedgehog replacement game screen for the NES, um, some Batman mosaics, Sonic mosaics, Lego and Apple logo mosaics, those sort of things. They come out really nice in the renders. Um, so go check that out. So it does latest comments, but what we want to... Oh, here's the... Um, Count subscribers, 351, 27 in the last 28 days. Views are up, watch time's up, everything's good. I think it's under analytics, so we're gonna go there. This is our analytics screen. And what's good is we, the number of views sh are shown here. That's not popping up. 3.3K views, which is 871 more than usual. That's in the last 28 days. So anything that says more than usual is good. That means it's up and obviously the green up and the tick is all good. So what I wanna see, is where is the bit oh and here's our most popular videos these 992 views in the last 28 days so this ikea detolf build video is actually on 9,000 views at the moment i think um obviously more recent videos show high here because this is just the top videos in the last 28 days so i'm kind of excluding shorts which are these ones so the top two are the ikea detolf and the lego product feedback sweepstakes and video which had 429 in just the last 28 days and that went up <laughs> in September 2020 so it's still getting a lot of views people still interested to know what Lego feedback is I guess if you do have a look um, but what I'm trying to find then is the stat maybe it's subscribers let's go to watch time first it's the stat that shows how many of your people that are watching are actually subscribers it might be audience okay let's here let's have a look here subscribers okay no so let's go to audience here. Okay, we might be getting here. We're getting somewhere here. Watch, right, here we go. Okay, so 73.6% of our watch time in the last 28 days have been from non-subscribers. So this is an appeal. If you're watching this video and you are finding it's not the first video you've watched, you've watched more than one, then maybe you might like our channel. So consider a sub. If not, maybe consider smashing that like button. Everything's down below. And what it says here is that those that have watched it in the last 28 days, 26.4 of them have subscribed. So that might be quite good. I mean, there are channels that have 95. I've seen some channels say that they've got 95% of viewers haven't subscribed. So if they can ask those 95% of people to maybe consider a sub, because it really does help channels, obviously subs do, likes do as well, but subscribers really do help push it over that threshold of a thousand if they want to monetize and etc etc so there's actually a see more here so i'm going to do that okay so it breaks down everything uh that's weird where the, those that have subscribed overtook those that weren't on the 29th of april interesting not quite sure what that's about sometimes there's glitches obviously in the youtube system but there we go um and it actually breaks down the views here to actually the percentage into actual views which is handy so yeah i guess we found it, it's quite easy actually, it didn't take long. It'd be really great if you could subscri subscribe. Lily would also love it. And I, I report to her now and again going, Lily, look, 351 subscribers. She was like, yay. Is there anything more here? 
age and gender. So 65% are male, 34% are female. Interesting. The, mo the most age is 25 to 34 years, possibly expected. And again, most visits from the United States. A lot from India, which I'm surprised. They're more from India than the UK. Interesting. Lots of love from India on the views. So people from India are viewing our videos, which is great. If you're in India, thank you. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button. But also Indonesia and the Philippines. They're a lot lower, 2.4% and 1.5%, so that's good still. But 7.8% from the United Kingdom. Okay, excellent. Subtitles, I don't know what that's about. I think that's it really for that audience. Bit and then unique views. There's obviously spikes here, but they're for shorts that I uploaded. They've got a load of views. But loads of people are saying that shorts is dead. If you think shorts is dead, let us know in the comments as well. You can confirm that for us. It's quite possible. And um, people not getting many shorts, video short hits. Mm. Subscribers, a lot of YouTube channels took off because of shorts. I know that's CN TV. They, they actually recommended that I do some more shorts because that's how they ended up getting a lot of subscribers. Which is, I think it's just timing really for that sort of stuff. So it's all about being in the right place at the right time sometimes. Um, so there's not really much on here that are pretty is worth showing you at the moment. Maybe I'll do another video and go into more detail on this. Sometimes people watching like to know a little bit of an insight into the stats of YouTube for YouTubers. A lot of time people show what, they, what they're what they earning on it as well. Maybe one day when, if we're ever monetizing, we do that as well. I think it gives a good insight as to how it all happens because if we end up monetizing, when we've got a thousand subscribers and get enough views, which I think is 4,000, what is it, 10, actually let's go to that. Monetization, so yeah, so here you need a thousand, and we're on 351, and you need 4,000 public watch hours within the last 12 months, and we've had 866. So the more subscribers we get, and the more watch hours we get, the better. Feel free to have a look at our playlists. We've got all different types of playlists, and we try and every time I do an upload, I pick the right playlist for the right thing. Um, there's quite a lot of playlists there. Some are a bit empty, some are fuller than others, they will all build up as we get more and more different theme sets. Um, so take a look at those if you can. So yeah, that's basically it. What did we say, 73%? Yep, 73.6% are not subscribed. So if you're one of those 73.6%, please say hi in the comments if you're watching this video. Oh, don't forget to enter into our subscriber wall. It's totally free. You just subscribe, let us know your name, let us know your color of brick, and it will add you into the wall but we'll also film it as we do it and then we'll let you know in the comments who we add, etc, etc, over time and also on our Instagram over time. So feel free to check that out. I think that's all. So thanks for watching. Um, like I say, don't forget to smash that like button and um, more videos soon. And I'm going to do a few more. What should I do? Oh yes, I wanted to review the Friends set, so I might do that next. And that might be in a future video. There's a new Friends set that's been advertised. Not the Lego Friends, but the Lego Friends TV set. Don't get confused. The old one was 21319. We have two of them up there. I'm thinking either both are investment sets or maybe one is for keeps. But we'll see. And I actually saw it in person. Went to Smith's yesterday to meet Gary. And he and I had a look at the display. And there's really good displays. They've got the... the Lego Cyan, Cyan, Lamborghini out, Technic. That's huge. I was very surprised at that. Um, but they also had Lego Friends Central Perk out. So that was interesting. And I really like that. And who's ringing me? Okay, my wife's ringing me. See you later in the next one. Um, there's more videos on uh -huh. my channel. Way more videos. But don't mention the number because this thing yeah. might repeat. <laughs> you have two options. Pick that one and watch more. And Lily, what one do you got? This one's really good. Is it really good? Yeah. I think my one's better. I think no, they should pick mine. No, no, mine's way better. No, this one. No, this is like the winner winner chicken dinner. No, definitely, definitely pick this one. 